we have a great garden update for you so come along and you're gonna see everything that we've planted how it's all growing and what else has been happening come on let's see Okay, so in the first row we have the onions and if you remember a couple of months ago we planted those, the little bulbs. Then in the second row we have the carrots. These are Danvers 126. They are lovely carrots and do really, really well. Next we have zinnias that we planted and we love zinnias. Then we have the cukes. No, actually, these ones are the pickles and these are homemade. Uh, that's the seed variety, homemade pickles, and they are great producers. And we actually haven't done anything to these sprayed or nothing. Um, they've been really disease resistant. Then we have some banana peppers. We also have some poblamo peppers. some bell peppers then we have a uh, butternut squash that's waltham some zucchini that variety is i believe that's black beauty that variety Then we have the San Marzano tomatoes, great for sauce. We have pineapples. I mean, who doesn't love pineapples? Then we have peppermint. Then we have Queen Anne's lace. That has a lot of medicinal uses. Then we have white yarrow. This is another herb. It's used for um, diarrhea, gas, stomach issues, colds, runny noses, arthritis. Then we have chives, which have beautiful flowers. Great for salads, putting on sandwiches. Chives is also an anti-inflammatory and it's great for sore throats. Then we have sorrel, has a lemony, zingy flavor and great for salads. These are parsnips, all American variety. Then these are the tomatoes that we planted a while back. And remember that they were um, only maybe seven, seven, eight inches high. Now they're about three feet high, San Marzano's. Then we pick some vegetables for blossom. Take care everyone, Jesus loves you.